conditioning isn't working. It's a bird. It's a plane. It's Best Man from Best Electric and Air. Thank you, Best Man. Oh, he is the best. Call today and receive our maintenance plan for only $8.95 a month. Turn to the experts for the best home maintenance plan in Southwest Florida. When you want the best, call Best Electric in there. And here he is. He took his cape off so he could sit down. Matt Moen from Best Electric and Air is the best man. Good morning, Matt. Good morning, Bill. Glad to have you back here to save the day. You've been in those situations before where, you know, you go to the thermostat, you know, it's the middle of July and it's 96 degrees in somebody's house. And That's you come right. to the rescue, That's right? That's right. We have a 24 hour day, seven day a week emergency on call service. You can call up our office anytime, day or night, and we'll be there within a couple hours. Okay, well, let's talk about searching for an air conditioning Certainly. company and the questions that you need to be asking. The, the cold, hard questions that you really need to ask when you're looking for the company to, to keep you uh, warm on, on the few chilly nights that Florida has, but mostly the air conditioner, which I would say you need 360 days a year. <laughs> questions we need to be asking. I like 365 and okay. the heat in All right. between. All right. Okay. All right, I'll go, I'll go for the whole year. All right, you got your top three questions. That's correct. The top three questions that you want to ask is, one, how long has the, uh, the business uh, been around? Okay, because if they're offering a 10-year warranty, they've been around six to seven years, what good is that for the consumer that's buying an air conditioning system with a 10-year warranty? If the business goes out of business, the warranty is, is no longer valid. Okay. For example, we've been around for 32 years. 32 years. 32 years. years. Three like, decades. More than three decades. That that's is right. legacy. That's that is history. Legacy. Older than you and I combined. You know, it, it's hard to believe. Okay, so 32 years, family owned. That's also important, right? That's correct. Family owned. The other thing you want to look for is their credentials. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, you want to make sure that they have a Better Business Bureau rating. Not that they're just on the Better Business Bureau because everyone pays to be on the BBB, but do they have an A plus rating? For example, we service 27,000 customers annually and we maintain an A-plus rating. That holds some credentials credibility. You say that 100 air conditioning companies in Southwest Florida are busted every year. That's right. Because... We were talking about that earlier. Yeah. That's right, because they're operating without a business license. So between Marco Island and Port Charlotte, around 100, uh, 100 air conditioning companies get, get, get arrested and charged with a felony for operating without a business license. So you license. could easily call one of the bad guys. That's right. And not the best and not, guy. No, that's correct. You want to make sure a company is pulling permits whenever they go to install a new air conditioning system. Uh, one of the other things you want to make sure of is that they're licensed, bonded, and insured. And for example, some of the other credentials that Best Electric and Air has is we won the Angie's List Award. We also won the Reader's Choice Awards for 2008, 2009, 2010, and we just won 2011. Reader's Choice Awards for Best Air Conditioning Service Company and Best Electric Service Congratulations. Company. Thank you, Bill. Well deserved. Not to toot my own horn. Uh, but. Go ahead. Go ahead and toot <laughs> it loud. And toot the horn of a company that is locally owned. You're locally that's, owned. That's correct. We are locally owned and operated. The reason why it's important to have a locally owned and operated company is because you want an owner who takes pride in his craftsmanship and who services his community and brings that money and those dollars back to different charitable organizations and whatnot. Let's talk about how in your the company, community. I'm sorry? Sorry, in the community. In the community, I'm sorry. <laughs> the community and all of that important and equally important is how you're organized and how well you're organized. That's correct. Tell us a little bit about the organization of best. Okay, we have a call center, so whenever a customer calls into our call center and they have uh, a need, a service need or whatnot, all of those calls are documented in our computer database and, and all of those calls are answered in a timely manner by our secretaries and our staff. What happens is we dispatch a technician out to a job and that technician is going to have a uniform, there are background checks done. The uh, customer actually gets a photograph sent to them of the technician and the background search that's been done. We use a web a web website to to promote this service so that consumers know who's coming into their home. So they're not just getting Billy Bob, the air conditioner guy, in there who's you know doesn't doesn't really have any kind of credentials or supportive backing as as far as providing the the uh, customer with uh, confidence and knowing that they're going to get good service all the way around. So if it were you, they would take a picture of your face. Click. That's correct. And they would know that this face is the one that they will see. This face right here. Ding dong. <laughs> that one right there. Ding dong. Knocking at your door. And it would be this guy. All right. Uh, trucks are clearly marked. That's correct. Our trucks are clearly marked and logoed. People may have seen them with the best man. This guy right here. He's uh -huh. flying around all of Southwest Florida between Mark Island and Port Charlotte. I love him. It's great. You may have seen our Navy trucks around town. I have. I'm too sure. So. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's really important that you have a company that's organized. Uniforms, you want to look for company trucks, uh, logos, make sure that they're clean, make sure that they're stocked properly. You want to make sure that you have organization in the company because if you're going to have somebody come out and service your air conditioning and they lack organization, 
Uh, I don't know that I'd want that guy servicing my equipment. How about the number of employees? Do you have at least 20 employees? We do. We do have over 20 employees, and that's important because if you have a small, not that the mom and pop companies are that bad, but if you have a small mom and pop company and they're busy and you have a service need, well, they're busy doing a new install and they can't get out to service your warranty work for maybe a couple weeks while wow, you're going to be without air in the middle of July for one to two weeks. And this has happened. This is commonplace here in Southwest Florida. In the so, middle of July, your air conditioning goes out. You get what's right. called a NATE. NATE. Certified. NATE certified technician. That's right. Um, we send out a NATE certified technician. NATE is an acronym for National Air Conditioning Technical Efficiency. And we send out a NATE qualified, NATE certified technician, and all of our technicians are NATE certified before they go out to the home. Hey, you got a special deal for everybody. We do, actually. All right, what's this? Let's show it to everybody and we do. give it their best All man. right, if you guys, if you customers, you great customers in Southwest Florida, buy a new air conditioning system this month, this month only, you will receive a $250 Visa gift card. 250 bucks. That's right. Pretty That's good. Right. Good deal. Thank From you, Best Bill. Electric and Air? From Best Electric and Air. Uh, a legacy, family-owned and operated company. That's the correct. The people whose number you want to have in the middle of August when your air conditioning system goes out, he's the man. I'm the man. The <laughs> hey, best man. You. Best man. Thank you, best man. Thank you, Bill. All right. Thanks Here's for having me on. You're welcome.